what's up y'all welcome to my channel i hope that all of my beautiful and my handsome collective out there is doing well so you guys it's going to be a collective reading it's going to be for anyone of any zodiac sign so if anything happened to resonate don't forget to like share subscribe and comment let your girl Bruce Lane know what's going on. If you are interested in a personal, my information will be in the description box below along with my intro songs, okay? All right, you guys, so let's get into it. So we're going to start off pulling some messages from my I Am deck, okay? So, like I said, if anything resonates, go and like this video. Ooh, damn, that came out quick. What does the collective need to know? Okay, you guys, you are leveling up, baby. And as you are leveling up, I feel like if things are starting to go your way and in your favor, as money is starting to come in, your business is starting to take off, whatever it is that you're leveling up in, spirit saying, move in silence, baby. Don't nobody need to know about this level up, okay? Some of you guys are in the public's eye, you know what I'm saying, or you have eyes on you. So people are going to see, you know, they're going to be able to feel the energy or whatever about what's going on around you. But I feel like just keep it to yourself. So I feel like as you're in this energy of leveling up, and like I said, things are starting to, you know, go in your favor. You're starting to see, like you can visually see a lot of times, you know, we can be leveling up, but we, we need to see something. But I feel like this is going to be a visual for you, okay? Continue to move in silence. Keep that shit to yourself because you never know who's watching, but who's praying for your downfall here, okay? All right, we also got thoughtful. I feel like some of you are very thoughtful. You have someone who thinks highly of you, okay? Some of you guys have someone someone who thinks very highly of you. Excuse me, I This could be someone who thinks highly of people, who thinks highly of you and because of this, you know what I'm saying? Maybe they want to do something special for you. And then we have starting the process. So I feel like for some of you, if you're not in this energy of feeling like you're leveling up and the momentum, momentum and things and the energies are starting to gain momentum, then you're starting some type of process. You're starting some type of journey here, okay? All right, y'all. So let's get into, let's pull here. Messages for my collective. What is it that my beautiful and my handsome collective, Holy Spirit, what is it that they need to know at this time? I love you guys. Messages for my collective. What is it that they need to know? Let's see one more. All right. Messages for the collective. What is it that my beautiful and handsome collective, what do they need to know? Ooh. Let me grab it. Okay. <laughs> so what shot on the floor is, okay, somebody wants to get, like, somebody wants to touch you and get physical. But this could be someone you could have friend zone, or this could be someone like you have in the friend zone. They're like, nah, collective. We just can't be more than friends. Uh, this is someone that's saying they want to be more than friends because what they want to do is touch you and get a little bit of physical. Okay, let's get physical. Somebody want to get physical with you, baby, and touch you all over your body. All right, y'all. Messages for my collective. Tell us more. What do they need to know? All right, I just want to be free, okay? So someone here could feel stuck or trapped, you know, in a certain way. Maybe someone is wanting to free their mind and their thought process. You know, someone could have a lot of ill thoughts all the time. Or maybe someone here just feels tied down or burdened, you know, or bound to a situation or something here. Tell us more. Okay, I'm protecting you from myself. So someone here could be putting some physical distance in between you and them okay this could be someone who is in a darker place in a very low place or dark energy right now and maybe this is someone who doesn't want to project you know that energy onto you or whatever it is this person's like going through like they don't want you to feel that energy here i cannot promise you anything okay so someone here could be like i'm not gonna say the word convinced Someone here could have told you, I'm going to work on myself, I'm going to do this, I'm going to give it a try. But it's like, 
they let you know, like, I ain't gonna promise you anything. Like, yeah, I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try to do this, but you know, I ain't gonna. Like, this gives me the energy of somebody that's gonna try, but maybe they're not gonna put their best foot forward, and they're not gonna give it 100 percent. Or maybe this is someone who made you a lot of promises, you know, in the past. So it's like they don't want to keep on, you know, making like a lot of empty promises here. I wish I could have the courage to stick up for myself, okay? So someone here feels like people just walk all over them and take advantage of them, okay? And I feel like for some of you, you know, you're not a pushover. This is somebody who's a pushover. Thank you, Siri. Someone here can realize that they're a pushover. You know, but really, what they really wish is they had the courage to just stick up for themselves and tell people no and be like, no, nah, I'm not going to do this. This is someone that's like a people please, but they always got to do what everybody else expect them to do or want them to do it nine times or ten times out of ten they don't be want to do this shit okay tell us more how spirit what is it that my beautiful and my handsome what is my beautiful and handsome collection what do they need to know messages for my collective i love you guys if anything is resonating don't forget to like this video let me get this card up okay so let's pull some more and see what else you need to know all right we got in saluable okay so i feel like you're someone like someone here like they're thirsty you know what i'm saying like they want more like you're someone who quenches this person thirst you know what i'm saying like they just can't get enough of you okay messages for but this could be someone that's a little cold though i'm looking at these ice cubes okay this could be someone that's a little cold and distant you know what i'm saying like they can be like their energy is kind of standoffish or cold or whatever but you're the person that they truly desire okay this could be someone who lusts you or like you and this person have a strong sexual chemistry or they could be very sexually attracted to you almost less than you in a way but i feel like their energy like the energy that they give you is not that like you don't feel this from this person okay this could be someone who's friends on you know what i'm saying they want more tell us more how to see it. <laughs> messages for my collection tell us more all right so for some of you yeah like some of this could be a past person, okay? Like, there is some type of magnetic or unexplainable pull this person has towards you. And it's like, they can't resist you. Like, someone here finds you simply irresistible here, okay? And they're hoping that you and this person can come together. They're hoping that you guys can reconnect and reunite, okay? This could be a spiritual connection for some of you. This could be your divine counterpart here. Or you have a soul contract with this person. And for some of you, something is projected to happen within this connection, all right? We got a projection of a few weeks, days, weeks. Uh, this could happen in the future, okay? This could happen in the next few days, weeks, or months. But this could have to do with some type of traveling here. Someone may have to travel to see you, or you may be traveling to see someone else. And this could happen in the future here. So let's go to the answer in time. Hold on. Okay, so we're going to pull up from my answer in time. And since we know we got a, a future prediction, that's what I'm saying. Something's going to happen in the future. For some of you, this is going to happen within the few days, the next few weeks, or the next few months. So let's see what's going on. Because we're speaking of the energy. Ooh, I just seen September. We're going to take it. All right, for some of you, this can happen in September. Maybe this is someone who's going to reach out, or you can hear from someone, or, you know, something could take place here. Let's pull some more messages for my collective. Tell us about this projection, Holy Spirit. Tell us about what's going to happen in the future. We're trying to see when in the future here. We got September. All right. Some of you and you and this person may have to compromise or like reach some type of agreement or something. Like agree to disagree or something. Ooh. It happened within the next six months. Okay. So some of you, this can be September. I did see December. This can happen before the summer's over with. We got to trust the universe. The trust that this is going to happen. And we have be yourself. So this means you ain't got to front, front and fake and, you know, do all this extra stuff. Just be yourself whenever this happens. So I feel like for some of you, this is like a conversation. And this could be an actual face-to-face. -face. 
because I'm looking at this card here. This could be an actual face-to-face -face conversation with you. So let's get the signs. Let's see who this is going to happen with. Messages for my collective. All right, so we got Capricorn, Gemini, Pisces, Virgo. Heavy Aquarius, Gemini, Leo. Libra, Scorpio, Sag, and Leo. All right, you guys, I love you. And until next time, stay blessed.